Sempuetana's attempt to drag South African men went south very fast, guys. It backfired so fast. <laughs> it's bad. Like she's being dragged left, right, and center, center on Twitter as I speak. And it all started when a tweet said, You got dribbled by your Ben's hands. Now you call us gold diggers. And then she said, I wish I was. SA men are the bottom of the burial. And that's where it all started because people came out to be like, What? What did you say, girl? What was that? You did not say that about south african men especially when it's coming from you you should be the last person to say that and the comments heated up guys one person said dear south african men if you want to make it in life please stay away from useless useless ladies like usimpiwe dana period like this person is saying just stay away from usimpiwe dana because she she fucks things up like she just <laughs> she just doesn't play yo so it comes to show guys because you know at times you must just learn to keep quiet like stay away from social media at times because you might say something and it might come back and bite you in the ass like big time another person said why do you guys want someone who has already fallen <laughs> like like, why do you guys want someone who has already fallen to fall? Because Abandabane have come out to say, You know, when it comes to her music game and all of that. So why are people wasting their time in the first place? Another person said, I think we are wasting our time with Usimpoe Dana or the hashtag rather. I mean, she, uh, she has already, I mean, she already fell. She's no longer... <laughs> She's no longer relevant. I doubt I'm a 2K Ugusi Ayamaz. I am a Maz Lapunje spot on. They don't know who she is. And like I said, more girls just should have kept quiet. Like, you know, at times it's just good to your fingertips are itchy. Just take your phone, put it aside, and chill. Another person <laughs> had to take out the receipts. They went digging. What this is one of the many toxic women our society does not talk about. How toxic can you be for a man to put his dignity aside and open a case against you? This is after Usimpue Dana handed herself over to the police for assaulting her ex-boyfriend. And we know Gusi that was a big case guys like she was in the media about that. So this person was like Zoglaya I'm gonna dig until I get something to bash you with and shut this up you know with basically and um the article says simply that i recently handed herself over to the police after her former lover had opened a case of her uh, of assault sorry and criminal injury against her it goes on to say that um this is domestic violence and um <laughs> the case has been opened, you know, by ex lover. Yeah, okay, so it explains the whole saga that went down when it comes to that. Um, <laughs> when it comes to this, all I'm gonna say is, um, it's better sometimes just to keep quiet. Don't try, you know, Twitter because Twitter will bite you, will come back and bite you in the ass. You know how tweets are like, there are people that literally work for Twitter, they work to bash other people, to slam them, and they're looking for you to say that one thing and it backfires. So, when it comes to this, and I'm just stepping back and say, girl, saying, girl. It's just something that you need to deal with and good luck with that. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, like and share this video. Mwah.